So glad you made it in. So glad. Welcome to Ray Dazzle's Dental Clinic. So, um, I was looking through your chart a little bit. Um, you're a new patient. You have not been here before. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Where you move here from? Nebraska. Oh, okay. Awesome. I've never been out there, but I heard it was beautiful. Um, so I was looking through your dental chart. Let's see here. Um, I was looking, trying to look at your medical history. We didn't get the x-rays from your old office, which is totally fine. We can take our own set. Um, so I'm just going to ask you a few questions um, regarding your um, medical history, just because you didn't check in, which is totally fine. Um, let's see. Okay, so HIV negative, right? Okay, you just didn't check it. Any heart problems running in the family? Okay, any bleeding problems running in the family? Okay, allergic, allergic to anything at all? No, no, okay, good. All right, what about amoxicillin? So you put like amoxicillin, but it's at the bottom? No, okay, that's fine, okay, good. So you just, it might make you just like rashy or sick, but so we'll just, if we have to ever prescribe you something, you'll be maybe clindamycin or something, okay? So, okay, good, we checked that out. All right, then let me go ahead and just fill out this form here, okay? And then we're going to end up filling this one out too. Okay, let's see. What's your name? Okay, your name is Sage. Okay, all right, Sage Lindy. Got it. How old are you, Sage? Okay, all, okay, great. Yeah, you're 21. Perfect. Um, all right, so I'm going to check you for cavities, everything like that. Um, my name is Rochelle, okay? I am your doctor for today. I'm your dentist. So if you have any questions, just stop me. Don't hesitate to ask, okay? Because I'm right here. Even if I do have my hands in your mouth, it'll be okay. I can still understand you, I promise. Okay, all right, let me put this right here. All right, I just checked your x-rays out. Uh, the hygienist took fabulous x-rays. Um, they look pretty good. Um, you do have some spots that are a little concerning to me. So now what I'm going to do is we're going to go ahead and check out everything for you, okay? Let's just look at every single tooth one by one and uh, go from there, okay? All right, I'm going to check um, you for, since it's been a minute, um, since you've been to a dentist, I'm going to check you for um, any oral cancer, um, or, um, any, you know, thing like that on your tongue, um, and just check you for cavities, see what type of cleaning you're due for since it has, um, been a little bit since you've been to a dentist. Um, so, all right, let's go ahead and start. Okay. Okay. So let's see her. I'm going to go ahead and we'll stick my mask on, wash my hands up here okay so what kind of hobbies do you have what kind of things do you like to get into horseback riding oh that's awesome that is really cool any competitions or thing local or is it all out of town right yeah oh, that's fabulous that's great that is awesome overachiever i like it okay so here we go i am um, going to start by Looking at your teeth one by one, okay? There's 32 teeth in the mouth. Um, so it looks like you had your wisdom teeth taken out. So your mom must have, you know, your parents probably got them taken out when you were like what, 15, 16, 17? Yeah, okay, good. Good, good for them. Okay, so let's go ahead. I'm gonna write your name. We're gonna chuck each tooth. So it looks like you have 28 teeth now. 28. Okay. So, here we go. All right. Um, I had Janice wrote down a few cavities that she looked at while she was taking your x-rays and just jotted down some things. I have it right, right here. Right here. And right here. So, I am going to just double check her, okay? Okay. Okay. So, let's see. Okay, let me make a few notes. All 
All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put my gloves on. So how long have you had braces? Since you were 17, well you're 21. Why didn't you go back to get them taken um, off? Yeah, I mean, teeth look pretty straight. And you know, we can just go ahead and put retainers on them. We need to look into that. You know, we do have an in-office orthodontist. So I kind of want her to check you out on that department, uh, in that department, if you don't mind, okay? Okay, all right, great. So here we go. All right. Uh, this is just a mirror, okay? Um, and this is just an explore. It's a little pointy. It's, I'm not gonna, it's not gonna bother you, I promise, okay? It just helps me see what I'm getting into and looking at the cavity. So let's start at the bottom, okay? We're just gonna start at the bottom arch. Where does she put that? There we go. I can see what the hygienist noted here. Okay, let's see. Okay. Yeah, is that, is that a little sensitive? Yeah, your molar, okay. Okay. Ooh, I do see, I do see a little cavity there. Okay, and then the DO on. Okay, good, good, good. Let's look over here. Okay. Oh yeah. It looks like you have a little cavity up here, but now with the braces being on so long, you also have what we call um, class five decay, buckle class five decay, and it is right at the gum line. Let me show you. Okay. So it'll be right here. That is what we call buckle class five decay. Okay. And you have quite a bit of it. Um, even on this upper and even on this upper here. Okay. So those are, you know, easy to fix. We'll just have to fix them with fillings. Um, are, are your teeth sensitive? Yeah. Okay. Well, that would be because of the, uh, decay at the gum line. So we can put fillings on that and then you'll be good to go. Okay. Um, let's see. Since you're here, what I'm going to do is, um, the dent or the hygienist, um, she, the hygienist went ahead and wrote all this up. I'm going to have her um, put your dates and everything in her findings as far as um, her probing or measuring the gum goes. So this is for her now. Um, what I'm, and then what we'll do is I'm going to go ahead and clean your teeth today. Okay. We'll go ahead and do that. To get that out of the way. Get your gums healthy because once you have, if you have healthy gums, then your teeth follow. Okay. Um, so what I want you to do though is don't just brush your teeth. It's important to also brush your gums. Okay, so let me go over that. Okay, a lot of people, what they do is they'll just take it and they'll just brush. Can you see? Can you see that in the mirror? Okay, good. Um, just just brush their teeth. Okay, but what you need to do is I'd like you to go into a circular motion. Okay, but I really want you to get those gums especially with the braces. You really need to get down there and get your gums. You need to you need to brush those gums, okay? And that will really help with the extra material ABBA that you're getting or just the extra plaque that you're getting at the gum line, okay? That's just what we call it. All right, so first let me clean your teeth. Then we're gonna do an oral cancer exam um, and go from there. And then we'll see you back to do some fillings, okay? All right, oh, let's see, let's go ahead. The hygienist is pretty booked, but I'm gonna go ahead and do this for her. I'm gonna help her out. So the dentist is gonna be cleaning your teeth today. Okay, so let me just take my scaler, my U15, and I'm gonna go ahead and start on the lower. We're gonna go around the lingual, remove some of that tartar that I see. Um, same thing on top, and then uh, we'll polish you up, okay? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Let me put, let me put this, I gotta get some extra. There we go. There we go. Okay. 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 You have any hobbies? What do you like to do? Oh, you're in school. Yeah. You're in college in school. Great. What are you studying for? You're getting your bachelor's. That's great. You want to be a dentist? No. 
Uh, it's not for everyone. It's definitely not for everyone. Okay. Business management. Oh, that'd be awesome. Great. Okay. Let's get these. Uh, oh, look at this. Look. Look at this. You see that? Oh, you can't see it. There's some tartar. We got some tartar there. Got a chunk of that tartar. Let me let me look look up around here. Okay. Yeah, the upper is not as bad. Okay. Let me let me go to the, the front part of your teeth here. Okay. Let's start right over here. Yeah, you know when you have braces, it makes it super tough to floss. Um, but you can floss and I would appreciate if you did, you'll thank me later. Okay. You will think, you will thank me later. Okay. All right. Let's get this. Let me get you to close now. Let's just get you to close and I'm going to just take. Make sure everything underneath your gums are clean. Good. Perfect. Okay. Do you like strawberry? I hope you do because that's all the perfect paste we have is strawberry. Okay. So. All right. Yeah, I will definitely get you an appointment with the hygienist, I mean with the orthodontist, so that we can get these braces off you. Your teeth don't need them. We can always put um, retainers on, and then you'll be good to go, okay? All right, so I'm going to go ahead and just take this and really polish you up. Not to mention, some of these are loose. You really need to... Uh, anyway, that's okay. We'll get it off. No problem. Okay, let's just polish every every single tooth. And I like to get down to the gum line. Yeah. And let's go on the upper, okay? Let's get the upper. Yeah, it's real gritty. It's okay. The grittiness will go away. I'm going to rinse out. Okay, just try not to swallow it. You want to hold the suction? Okay. Here you go. All right, yeah, just put the suction right down in here. Okay, yeah, anytime you want to use it, just close real fast and then open. I'll wait for you, okay? Not a problem, not a problem. No, you're fine. It's not a problem, not a problem at all. Okay, let's get this right around these braces. It's going to be a little tricky. Just close again. It's going to be a little tricky, but we got it. Oh, that's sensitive. Yeah, it's those class five, local class five cavities you have there. Okay. Okay. Let me put this away. I'm going to rinse you out really good. Let's just get you to rinse with some of this good mouthwash, okay? Okay, yeah, there you go. All right, just take it. Take it, yeah, go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just spit it back in here. Spit it, no, spit it, spit it back in here. Okay, good job, good job, good job, good job. The grittiness is gone? Good, told you. All right, so we can't use our regular floss. Okay, we can't. So what we're gonna do is I have some little flossers. I brought a few. I really like these flossers, but I have the Dentac flossers for when you have braces, okay? It's like a little Christmas tree. Let me open it for you. Like a little Christmas tree. Okay, so you're going to open it like so, okay? And it looks like, like just a little Christmas tree. So what you're going to do is until we get these braces off, I want you to take it, um, 
let's see, we'll take it and you are going to go in between from the bottom up and you're just going to, you're just going to see how I'm doing that. Yeah. You just go in between your braces. You really, 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 really want to clean that because you know what you don't want. You don't want stains when we get those braces off, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and get my assistant to get you a good bag with some extra of those in. And um, then next time I want to check your gums again and make sure they're not bleeding or anything like that, okay? Um, so... Now I'm going to go ahead and scrape your tongue. We have a tongue scraper. These are awesome. Um, so I need you, I need you to open. Okay. I need you to go ahead and open. See, this thing is loose. We need to get this off of there ASAP. Okay. So I'm going to take this tongue scraper. It has a side with some little bristles on it. Okay. That's the side um, that you want to use at first. And it's going to scrub the bacteria. You know, the tongue has a lot of bacteria. It's going to scrub that bacteria. So you're going to start all the way in the back, okay? Don't gag yourself or anything. And you're just going to scrub a little bit. Then take the other side. And you're going to start in the back and run it forward. Just start in the back and run it forward. Start in the back and run it forward, okay? And then I want you to rinse again with some good Listerine mouthwash. Listerine is the best. Um, the total complete Listerine is totally fine. Um, just don't use it too, too often because sometimes if you start getting a white tongue or your tissue starting to slough, you know, like on the cheeks, it'll, the tissue will come off just a little bit, then back off the Listerine. Okay. But that's what I recommend for you. Okay. All right. So, um, what we're going to do is, um, look in your mouth now. Let's look, let's do an OCE exam. Okay. All right, so what I'm going to have to do is um, turn off the lights and have you swish one more time with some um, of this other stuff. Okay, swish. Yeah, you're going to take it. Swish. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Spit it back in. Yep, yep. Perfect. Okay, um, and now what I'm going to do is it it will, any if you have any kind of lesions, um, canker sores even, or just anything cancerous, it'll glow just uh, a little bit and then we'll do a biopsy, but hopefully we won't find anything. You're not a smoker, are you? No? Good. Thank goodness. Good job. You don't dip? Nothing like that? Okay, good. Let me turn off the lights. Okay, so I turn off the lights. I'm going to go ahead take this it's gonna look blue and anything that we see in the mouth it'll glow if it's suspicious okay all right we already give you the rinse okay good job okay all right so I'm just going to I'm gonna go ahead and just just go like this in your mouth okay I'm just gonna I'm just gonna run it and go like this in your mouth Okay, all right, and let's see. Let's check under that tongue. Okay, okay. All right. Let me get my mirror. I need to see a little bit better than this. Got the big one. The light's not working, unfortunately, in it. So, let's see. Anything? Nope, you're the doctor. Your palate looks amazing. Okay, your tongue. Yeah, good. I don't see anything suspicious. You're all in the clear. You're OCE negative. Okay. All right. Let me turn the lights back on. All right. Okay. I'm going to look in your throat. I want you to take, stick out your tongue for me, okay? All right, let's do that. Yep. Go, ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah, 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 okay. All right, now go ahead, go ahead and stick out your tongue. Stick out your tongue for me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just, let me get my two by two. Okay, come here, I'm gonna hold it. All right. 
Okay, let's check. Yep, I'm, I know I'm holding your tongue. I'm sorry. I know it's uncomfortable for a minute. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Yep, you're all clear. You're good. Awesome. All right, I'm going to go ahead and take off my gloves and my mask. Okay. I know we're still checking temperatures. I know they checked your temp on your way in. So we are still checking temperatures because COVID. COVID will be around for a while. So, you know, keep everyone safe. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just fill out this chart for you. Let's see. Okay. She'll mark those. She'll. Okay. You do have cavities. I'm going to circle it. Okay. Okay, your exam's done. Cleaning. Okay, we didn't have to use the drill today. Um, I hate that they even call it a drill, but uh, our high-speed handpiece, we didn't have to do all that in your mouth today. So, um, but next time I really need to get you in, we'll start these cavities, okay? Usually I like to do the posterior or the back teeth first and then the front teeth, okay? Okay, uh, you have your you have your braces, but we really are going to look at giving you something like this. It's a plastic retainer or a rubber based retainer. Okay, so we just take an impression of your teeth, um, and then each retainer is sculpted especially for your teeth. Okay, and then you'll just wear them instead of uh, those braces. You'll be so happy, I promise. Um, so I'm gonna have that her schedule you for that schedule okay and you don't need any extractions you're good on that no teeth need to come out um you need to brush after every meal every single meal even if you have soda you know i know i know when you have soda though wait about 30 minutes so that the um you, a lot of time when the acid um, sits on your teeth and it starts erosion um, and you brush immediately it's really not healthy so wait about 30 minutes after you drink a soda and then go ahead and brush okay um water is the best um thing to drink though for you okay and take those vitamins okay floss daily rinse out with mouthwash every day okay so go ahead take this chart take this chart right here Um, up to the front desk and they will go ahead and schedule you for your first filling okay all right it was so nice to meet you sage so nice and thank you for coming i hope you enjoyed your your visit yeah okay well i have a card up front the ladies up front will give you my um personal number um for emergencies only of course if you need me just let me know okay okay all right will you take care and i will see you Next week, right? Next week for the filling? All right. All right. Bye.